looking at too much stone here. All right. Let's do that. Nope. I want you there. Boom. All right. So we are going to use that. No, but we're not going to do that. Okay. So, you know, you the building game is really tedious and it's kind of slow, but you want to kind of just place things and then see how they look. Um, and I think the issue that we're having here is that this is too high. So, ooh, it's a waste of dirt, but I'm going to try it anyways. So we get some dirt there. We're going to need more wood planks. Four. That may not be enough, but let's take a look. Uh, I know a lot of people have been doing this here, so let's try it out. Mm, nope. I don't like it. Okay, so I think what we're going to have to do, uh, I'm going to have to try to figure out how to get that a little bit more open and you know what it may end up being that it's got to be lower let's try it one more time with this a little bit lower um maybe with the slanted here eh, that's better i like that this in terms of the levels i like that that's there um i'm just not sold give me that on the fact that that's the floor Now, of course, there is one way to solve this. Now, if there was glass here, then it'd be perfect. Ooh, oh, I'm going to do it. I know I'm going <laughs> to, I know what I'm going to do. And it's going to be really expensive, but I'm going to do it for you guys. I'm going to do it for you because um, that's what this channel is about. It's for you guys and eventually for me. Ooh, at least they give you a lot. Ugh, just wasted. Ugh. Ugh. Makeshift windows. I did it. I d Ooh, you know what? I got an idea. I have an even better idea. Okay. So we've got two more stairs left. Let's break this out here. I don't care about the cobble. And boom. Okay. I like that. I like that. Maybe even... Can't see anything there, so let's get another piece of cobblestone. Let's get this up, and let's throw down one of these guys here. No, 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 no. Ooh, I didn't mean that. Derp. Let's throw down one of these guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Much better, much better. Uh, so let's... Boom. Uh, boom. Okay. I'm using a lot more brick than I wanted to, but it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, because it doesn't matter. <laughs> it does not matter. So I'm going to line this place. That's nice, that's nice. Very good. Very good. Okay, boom. Yes, I like it, except for that right there. That's not good. A little bit of OCD kicking in. Boom. And I'll fix it on the other side. So that just solved our dilemma. It was an expensive fix, but it definitely solved it. So now that we're looking now we're looking on the from the outside, we've got the metal bars coming in. It's kind of like a window, uh, a cheaper way to make a window. Um, so that's good. Now I can take this very, very delicate dirt and we're gonna put it back in the box I'm gonna eventually use that um, oh and I got this powered rail somebody was doing a drop sale so I think a lot of people like to do um, people have been doing drop stuff so when they restart their islands they're like I got a bunch of stuff that I don't need so they go to a spawn and they just throw stuff on the floor and then people clamor over it like little vultures and I happen to be a vulture <laughs> so yeah we've got 11 powered rails I don't know what I'm gonna use with for because red so it's so dark darn expensive um, all right so now we've got the basic frame here we've got a decent job going on um, we've got things growing 
dang. Um, so now we add different layers. Now let's take a look. Uh, this is kind of my go-to. I like to use the wood on the outside. And the reason being is it kind of gives you a little bit more structure. Uh, you know, you're using these wood logs to kind of hold up the roof on top of the other structures, which is, you know, it's solid. It's good. And it gives you, you know, again, that depth that people kind of look for uh, in great builds. And this is another reason why we're, uh, we're running out of money <laughs> is that I've been building, you know, and so usually what would happen is I would you know, grab all this stuff and then I would sell it and make a huge profit. But um, you can't sell it if you're using it. So outside. So, yeah. All right. What else? What else do we want? What else has happened to me uh, since we last talked? Excuse me. All right. Yes, that reminds me. All right. So I'm going to ask you guys this question and you're probably not going to get back to me until, you know, episode about, I don't know, a hundred <laughs> when everybody starts to actually subscribe to me uh, in bulk, of course. And uh, yeah. So <laughs> um, so what happened to me today? So we uh, we ordered grinders or subs or whatever you guys want to call it because everybody calls it a little bit different but uh i call it subs but my a sub but my fiance calls it a grinder that's kind of what she grew up on and um so yeah we go to this pizza shop locally uh in the town that we live in and we we honestly we love them they they make really good food uh and their subs are huge i mean literally humongous we pay ten dollars a sub but it's like twice the size of a subway foot long uh and you know that gives us lunch and dinner for the next day which is awesome i mean and and we've had pizza from them and we've you know we've been go we've been cut loyal customers of them probably for about two three years now ever since we moved into this apartment and everything has been great up until recently. Now, I don't know if they had somebody new that was hired. I don't know. I, you know, I don't know if somebody's just, just slacking. I don't, I, I don't know. But the past two times that we've been there have been terrible, like beyond terrible. I, I don't even know who this company is anymore. Uh, you know, the first thing that happened was uh, we had the last, ooh, what am I doing? Grabbing stuff. Uh, the last time we ordered, we had, we ordered a pizza and we ordered a half veggie, half cheese pizza, just because, you know, we wanted something light where we this was, oh yeah, yeah, this is why we were, uh, cleaning. So we wanted to get something that we can pick at, uh, and easily eat while we, you know, maneuver. We didn't have to dirty any plates cause we just eat over the, uh, over the box. And they use, yeah, yeah. now literally this yeah, yeah. pizza place is probably about five minutes down the road. Yeah. Five minutes. I, you know, I, I, we usually go and pick it up ourselves, but uh, tonight we, you know, that night we decided to uh, get a delivery. Uh, and so I can understand being busy, but they were like an, an hour and a half went by and we hadn't gotten our food. So I was like, this is suspicious. Maybe, maybe something happened. Now, you know, we're in an apartment. It's not a very big apartment. You know, it's, it's a decent size, but, you know, it doesn't matter where you are in the apartment. You can hear the buzzer. You know, when someone wants to get in and they buzz us, you can hear it in, all the way in the back bathroom. You can hear it anywhere. So we didn't hear it. And so an hour and a half goes by and we call back. Oh, yeah, yeah they came by. They said they were just there, but nobody answered. And we're like, I, I don't think so. No, 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 no. And they're like, all right, well, we'll send it right away, which seemed, you know, that comment in itself seemed really suspicious. It kind of sounded like they had just uh, forgotten about us, which, you know what, can happen. I'm okay with that. So we finally get our pizza, and it's cold. And that's not okay. You know, the box was kind of warm because they left it in a warmer with other pizzas. But our pizza was cold. So we weren't happy. We called up. We said we were loyal customers, and we want to know what's going on. And they're like, well, we could either make you another pizza uh, or we could give you a credit. And at this point, it had already been, you know, two hours later. And we're like, we're just going to eat this one. We're not happy about it. We're going to eat it, um, and we'll take a credit for next time because we like you guys. We order for you all the time. 
All right, fast forward to today. So today we wanted to order some subs, some grinders, again, whatever you want to call it. So we're like, all right, oh, yeah, let's go to Venice Pizza again. Ooh, I just said their name over the screen. Well, there's the plug. They're usually very good. If you're from the area that I am and you know what store I'm talking about, get there. They're usually good. So we, we order from this place. We have a, you know, and they said, you know, we give them our delivery. We give them our address. Yes, we have a credit. And so what happens an hour later again? <laughs> no food. Not good at all. So, yes, we had our food late again. Not happy. But at least when it came, uh, the normal delivery guy who usually brings it was there. Uh, and, you know, he kind of explained that it was crazy busy today and, and our food was warm. So at least this time it was it was acceptable, you know, because our food was OK. But, you know, it wasn't made to the same quality as it usually was. So either they were in a rush or whatever. Needless to say, we're still not happy. So what do you guys do? You know, it's your favorite place to eat. You know, uh, as far as takeout goes, they give you really good rates. So what do you do? Twice in a row, they mess up your order or they're late? Do we do we tough it out, say, well, you know, it is what it is, they're a business? Or do we say, well, you know what, even though they do usually give good deals, you know, we give up on you. Because this is twice in a row. I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments because, and let me know if you guys have had similar experiences with places around you. You know, I, I know that there are notoriously bad, badly run restaurants, but, you know, I don't know if there's anybody that's percent, you know, per se, just usually good, but they just had multiple bad days and you, you kind of had it. Oh, I think I like that. So, I don't know. Uh, you know, that was, that was my weekend, but, you know, so we got our, our food, but it wasn't, it was subpar today. Come on, lag. Ooh, hi. Do what you're supposed to do. All right, so I think that I'm going to take this, put you like this. I kind of like this. I like this because it, I like rounding out the bottoms of buildings. Uh, and I think it, and I didn't necessarily do it with that one over there yet. Um, but that one's kind of a different type of building. So, and it was kind of something that I don't normally do. So it's a little out of my comfort uh, area. And actually, no, I did. I did round it out. Never mind. What am I thinking? Derp. Um, so yeah, I like rounding it out. I think it just feels complete. Uh, most buildings, you know, we'll just say bigger buildings kind of have that extra block. And I guess it's, it's more for support. Um, you know, there are other houses that don't necessarily need that. But again, if you look at kind of like a foundation of a house, You'll, you'll see, even with a foundation, it's a little bit wider than where your house normally is. So, I definitely like that. I'm not going to do it on the top. I need to actually put... I'm going to end up putting a regular roof in there. And I think I'm going to end up putting maybe maybe an awning. I don't know. We'll see. Um, so, so yeah, this building's coming along. It's it's coming around decently. And, it, again, for the purpose of what it's supposed to do. And I'm, I'm what I'm going to end up doing with this one is I may end up just kind of beating it up a little bit. So, I've got... You've got the cobblestone here and the smooth stone here. I may end up like kind of taking these and sprinkling them in here because you'll have that, that way it kind of looks like, you know, parts of this stuff is beat up here. Uh, so, so yeah, so the main structure of the building is pretty much complete, you know, and this, this building isn't going to be doing too, too much as far as, um, you know, extras goes. But so what we're going to have is we're going to have again, the, um, the furnace is here, and then we're gonna have, uh, in a, you know, an anvil heel here. Maybe we're gonna need some chests. Um, so some chests probably over here because we're gonna need some storage for coal, which most of our storage is gonna be over here. But this is kind of like a quick draw type of deal. So we'll use this until we're full. Then we kind of backfill from the storage or whatever goes overboard. We'll you know we'll put in the other storage room. Um, so most of the stuff that we're going to get, it's going to go in here and it's going to be, uh, kind of, you know, this is going to be where the powerhouse of our building goes. Uh, and again, you know, the roof will come. Uh, so, and I think I'm going to, I'm going to end up having the, you know, an overhang kind of roof. Um, it may end up being like that. 
and maybe an all around type. I'm not sure, but this is kind of a, a filler building. It kind of adds, a, makes it kind of look like a corridor here, which is nice. Uh, so, so yeah, so let's take a look at the time real quick. Where am I in the recording? Mm. We are looking at, I don't know. I'm gonna, uh, all right, we're getting pretty close. So, yeah. All right, so um, so what's what's coming up next? All right, so uh, I know that I'm gonna want to fin obviously finish out off the forge. The forge is gonna be where we're gonna be doing a lot of our cooking stuff. Um, that way I can actually take out the ones that are in the second store of the storage uh, and put it down here. So this is where that's gonna happen. Um, and then from there, you know, I'm gonna be doing a lot of this um, kind of tree growing because I need a lot of this uh, spruce wood and why because I want to use it kind of as as the roofs you know I was talking about the contrast stuff over there uh, and so if we look at here oops, second floor um, second floor has been you know kind of where I've been doing all the stone if I didn't mention um, so we've got some cobblestone we've got some smooth stone and bricks um, so all this is going to be primarily that plus some extra stuff so maybe I'll have some wool storage in here um, but yeah the wool the wool is really important um, we're kind of missing out on a lot of different building techniques um, and, and abilities because we don't have uh, the different color wools and so you know on top of being lucrative in, ter in terms of the price um, we don't have the ability to make wood or wool so we're missing out about 16 different colors worth of, of blocks so um, that's gonna be something that I'm looking to do next so I'm gonna have to actually sell some of my stuff I'm gonna have to make some money so that I can uh, get some sheep eggs I think I'm gonna need four thousand gold to get two sheep eggs so that I can start my farm um, and then from there you know the, the sheep's gonna start off primarily just white wool so I can kind of dye it where I need it to go and then um, I think I want to have about I think four of each color. Yeah. So I'll start off making four of each color, which uh, is not going to be easy. It's going to be kind of a pain. I've done it before where you have large scale pens type deal. Um, but yeah, so we're going to need to do that. We're going to need to put the, sh the sheep somewhere. Um, and I think it's going to end up being somewhere on that side. Maybe I may pull the road back or on the back. So if we look at our roads here too. Um, so we've got a road coming here. We've got a. This is going to be like a block, right? So we've got this building here. We're going to have maybe three more buildings there, maybe just two in a garden or something. But this is going to be a block here. Um, we've got the roads that kind of come out and around. So this, if we look at over here, our road curves around and it stops over in this section. Now, if we remember correctly, this is going to come down. So, um, and this here is going to go over once it's actually filled it'll probably finish at about right there right so we may have a road that kind of comes out that way so that may end up not being as round as we like and so the road may end up continuing that way and kind of backfill that way so so yeah so there's another block which the block that one would have been a two block um road because we've got the chicken farm we've got the cow farm um and then so we'll have another one here um, so I think the road may come around back that way and we'll have the sheeps on that side. Um, and so what's next from there? Well, it, from there, I'm going to want, because we're actually having uh, people come over very frequently, I'm, I may end up building like a hotel area, maybe like an apartment complex. Um, and so that's going to be a pretty big building. We're going to want to have, you know, a building that has like a base floor, um, you know, with a sign showing, you know, who owns what room on what floor uh, and then you know we're going to have different floors that have different amount of rooms and each room is going to have a bed it's going to have a chest uh, or a double chest for storage maybe um, you know there's going to be an ender chest in the bottom kind of a, a group storage type area and so that'll be that'll be for that and, and I think that'll be a nice addition um, kind of to enable the community to come by because we haven't really had that you know they people have come by and take a look at stuff and say oh I like it it's very nice it's neat um, which is which is true you know I pride myself in that because it's for you remember that, remember that. it's for you um, you know I've been to other 
to other uh, islands and they're kind of random. People are just kind of getting things done. But they're getting things done a lot faster than I am. You know, you, you go to a place and everything's scrambled all over the place, but they have diamond gear and they sell and they make money. Um, we'll get there, but we'll get there in a very pretty and effective, effective manner. <laughs> and then, um, so yeah, so there may it may end up being that I build the the apartment complex. It may end up being that I choose to do something else. And so, um, you know, one thing I kind of thought maybe I turn that into the apartment complex. You know, something a little bit bigger. You get the front lobby here. You get a hallway that kind of goes back this way, and maybe it comes up. Maybe I don't know. Who knows? So I may end up build, you know, refurbishing that building into something else, which if it does, then I can end up, you know, maybe sealing some of these off and, and kind of using this a little bit better. But um, who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Nobody knows until I actually do it. Um, so, yeah, that that is an actual it's a very large possibility that this building structure ends up being the. Uh, the lobby or the the apartment area or the hotel or whatever you want to call it. So, um, so this may be the building that we work on next. And so, uh, what I may end up doing is having all the production on that side or just kind of pushed off random. So there's going to be less of a plan as when I had before, but more of a plan, of course. So, all right, guys, I think that's going to do it. I think that, you know, we've gotten a little bit accomplished on camera. And, you know, for the next episode, this will be finished. Uh, it may end up being changed. I may end up, oh, I may end up doing something stupid like this. Ah, okay. Uh, and breaking up the monotony here. Let's try this. No, 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 no. No, why, why, you, why you do that? Why, why, why? Okay. Let's there we go. Much better. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. And I'm getting to the point where I'm doing stuff I shouldn't be. Um let's put that back. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so when when we come back in episode 18, let's get out of the rain. Yuck. Um, when we come back, this building will be finished. We'll go do an overview of that. Um, and so we'll, we'll look at, at some of the finer things. Um, and then, you know, and then we'll see what from there. I think, again, I'm, I may expand upon the roads, kind of build out a little bit. Um, but I may do what I said before. Again, out of the rain. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. People really like this, too. They love this idea of having this little underground passage. Plus, you can travel so much faster. Jump, 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 jump. So, <laughs> anyways, now that I've just had a jump fest, um, we're going to cut the episode here, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments, please. Leave a like, subscribe, anything like that uh, for more episodes. And as I said before, follow me on Twitter. Oh, no, no, no. Follow me on Twitter as I fight this spider. Um, so we'll see you next time, guys. Bye bye. Here we go. <laughs>